it's mm, dinner. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kyra Sean. So today's video is brought to you by Unice Hair. They were kind of to send me another unit to review for you guys. This is another sip and slay, so you know how this goes. Okay, we got our wine on deck, our wig on deck, our bare face on deck. Not all the time, but today it is, okay? As always, before we get into the specs and what I think about the unit straight out the pack, make sure if you're new to the channel, you go ahead and subscribe and smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Also, give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this in the future. Okay, so let's go. Okay, so before we get into this wig, <laughs> you know why I'm here. So let's go ahead and get into this wine real quick. Today, I finally found it, okay, from Target. I got my Stella Rosa Black. Some of you guys have been ranting and raving about this wine, so I must say, it better be good. I'm gonna be asking somebody for my refund, okay? Let's go ahead and crack her open. Oh, goodness gracious, come on. Let's do, let's do a little. Let's do a little bit. Waste not, one not. <laughs> mm, okay. Okay, I like that. <laughs> I could drink this daily. <laughs> So like I said, this unit comes to us from Unice Hair. It is part of their Bet You series. It comes in a natural color, and the starting price for this unit is $80.71. Now you know, depending on your specs of your unit, that price can go up. So let's go ahead and talk about my specs really quick. You can either get this unit in a 13 by four or a 13 by six lace parting area, 130% or 150% density, and 12 to 36 inches. So my particular specs is 13 by four lace parting area, 150% density, and 12 inches. And my unit is $100.71. Change purse activated. Okay. So this is what that unit is looking like. It comes with a little bit of a pre-plug hairline, not too much. You can see right here how that was looking. I also went in and plucked the hairline up just a little bit for my liking. It also has two combs in the front, one comb in the back and the adjustable straps. You also get the adjustable elastic band that you can sew into the cap if you want to. This is what that unit is looking like after I co-washed it. You can see right here, I went in with my Garnier Fructis Mega Thickening Lotion just to thicken up the hair a little bit. I don't really know if this does anything. I, I really don't. Like I use it when I feel like the unit looks a little thin. Okay, so let's go ahead and put her on. Do I need to take the straps off? Yes, I do. <laughs> Average cap size when you get units like this, like 22 to 22 and a half, I would say. Don't think I'm gonna put any powder under that just yet. Actually, I am. I, what's that? What is that? So I'm gonna go in with a mixture of my two uh, pressed powders by Maybelline Fit Me. This is the 360 and the 330 um, Fit Me powder. So I'm gonna use that on my hairline just to kind of blend those knots in because you can definitely see those. Just a little dusting. Let me not rip this joint. That'll be tragic. Didn't mean to do that, but okay. Now, if I do have a code for this unit, it will be linked down below, so make sure you guys look for that. If I put a straw on my wine, does that make me fancy? Fancy or ghetto? I don't know. I do the same lay down every time, y'all, so it's nothing, you know, extra, but if you want a detailed look of how I lay my wigs down, I do have a playlist, so you can do that. I change it up sometimes, but the last couple times I've been doing the same thing, so you know. Very simple. If you lay it down in sections, it'll be a lot easier, which I have learned, so that's why I do it like that. We're gonna tie it down using my Glee Made uh, Edge Wrapper. You guys know it's linked down below. Anything you guys see in this video is always linked down below. If it's not linked down below, just go ahead and ask me. Some of y'all be 30 seconds into the video asking me questions about something that's in the video. Like, God dang, can you just wait, wait a second? <laughs> But I know y'all be excited just like me, so it's okay, it's okay, I understand, I understand. But let me go ahead and get this makeup done and we'll come back and we'll style it together, okay? okay so makeup is done, hair is laid down. Now let's put some curls in her. She does have some layers in here, so it's not exactly 12 inches all the way around. It's like eight to 10 inches in the front and then the longest piece is 12 inches in the back. So I'm hoping this curls the way that I want it to, because if it don't, I'm gonna be pissed. <laughs> Big Bertha is back today, okay, because the curls that I want, I want it to be loose. Okay, we're gonna do a little loosey-goosey here. I don't even know how my lace looks because I don't got my glasses on. Let me see, let me see. She, she looks okay, she looks good, she looks good. And then we are going to, ooh, oh, I thought I, thought I burned my ear. <laughs> I was jumping before I even knew it. Because this is not a high density, it's not gonna take long to curl this hair at all. So if you're looking for a low maintenance human hair unit, there you go. This is definitely not a unit that you can pull out the pack and put on your head, okay? Nothing crazy, nothing crazy. And yes, it did get dark outside, so clearly I'm not filming this this morning. <laughs> I know some of y'all be like, you drinking wine this early? What? <sighs> this is pre-recorded, guys. Okay, I'm gonna put one big curl right here so I can see how the layers fall. One big curl right there. And then another one right here. Hey, Big Bertha be coming in handy, y'all, I swear. Y'all know I just curl every which way. Let the hair do what's gonna do. Looking a little like a mullet right now, but we gonna fix it, we gonna fix it. <laughs> I mean, I wanna party, but not like that. 
let me get this combed over because right now she not falling the way I want her to. Put some mousse right here in the front on these little swoops here. Excuse me. Y'all are. <laughs> Um, I know some of you guys do not like the baby hairs or the swoops or whatever you want to call it But just understand th this is my hair. So let me do what I want to do on my head Okay, keep it cute or get put on mute word to the wise. Okay <laughs> Y'all know I block you know I block but for the most part we don't got them problems Okay, y'all be keeping it real positive in the comments and if y'all see somebody that's not being positive y'all quick to point them out <laughs> You don't get a lot of parting space here on the side, so just be mindful of that. Put some volume up in there, y'all. Put some volume up in there. Mm, that's good, that's good, that's good. Okay, so with this cut and this curl, um, not cut and curl, but with this cut and this length, um, you could definitely wear this unit every day. Um, I really just wish, ooh, wait a minute, wait a minute, Kai. <laughs> I just really wish it was a 180 or like the layers on the bottom were a little bit thicker but you know the layers in the front are just a little bit a little bit too short for me so it's not giving me the look that I necessarily want like this cut is just giving me rich stay-at-home mom tees that's what I'm getting rich stay-at-home mom you know what I'm saying like when they had that cut and their hair is kind of all over the place but it still look good the makeup is always done like even when they go to sleep their makeup is on point when they wake up their makeup is on point she always got a glass of wine in her hand kids mm. Dinner. <laughs> Hello, Miss Jenkins. <laughs> so this is how this unit is looking now that I have curled her. Again, be mindful that the unit does have layers in it, in it, at least the one that I got. So I would say if you are someone who wants more of a longer length in the front, definitely get the 14 or the 16 inch because I feel like it will give you a little bit longer length here in the front that if you can go in and chop the longer length on the bottom, it will give you the look that I was trying to go for. It didn't really work out the way that I wanted it to, but you know, it's okay. We finesse over here. We, we make it do what it do. Would I still rock this unit? Yes. Why? Because it's me, okay? And I do what I want. <laughs> um, I would even go as far as to do like a little pin back action like that. Let's see? See? <laughs> Like this, I don't know. Say, I want to put like a little headband on. Do I got another headband? And there we go with that. Okay, so you can even do something like this. I look, I'm about to go play tennis. I mean, yeah, mm, yeah, mm. <laughs> Okay, so you make the unit work for you. This is how that's looking, okay? Again, nothing crazy. Um, you can style it up the way you want to. If you wanna pin it back, do some looks like that. You can do that. If you wanna chop the longer length off, or you know, on the bottom, you can do that, make it into a shorter bob. The only thing I wish is that the unit was one length all the way around. That is my only con with this unit. But yeah, that's all I got, you guys. We'll put the specs and direct link for my unit down below, as well as a coupon code if I have one, so you guys can save some more coin. Shout out one more time to you nice hair for sending me this unit. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Also smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I had to come and show you guys real this real quick. I did go back and use the bed head spray as you see right here um, to go take some pictures and I actually like how that looks. Let me see if I spray this right there. Just keep that. Y'all see how that did that? That joint just held that joint. <laughs> <laughs> it just held it right in place. Okay, okay. That's all I got, y'all. I love you guys so much. Bye.